All right, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another Dokkan battle video. So this is a follow-up to that Super Saiyan 4 Vegito Global Shaft video that I made earlier this morning with the thumbnail that people seem to really, really like. A big shout out to my thumbnail guy Narratus for that masterpiece. He actually drew the global Super Saiyan 4 Vegito himself, so great work on his end. But uh, anyways guys, this morning I woke up to a new tweet from the official Global Dokkan Twitter page that essentially says that uh, our voices have been heard, they you know, saw the outrage, saw the backlash, and they're gonna do something about it. Okay, so it says, uh, certain character details shown on the posted images were found to be incorrect. Images with correct information are in preparation and will be uploaded once ready. The incorrect images will then be deleted. We sincerely apologize for any inconvenience caused. Okay, so of course, they're most likely referring to the Super Saiyan 4 Vegito details that were posted last night that caused uh, quite a bit of a stir in the Dokkan community, especially the global side, because the Super Saiyan 4 Vegito 4 Global, when compared to the JP version, was just straight up inferior like he was just objectively wait subjectively is objective the one where it's like not an opinion or is it subjective i get those two mixed up all the time anyways it was just straight up a worse version of the you know same unit for global right and it just made no sense and i was super upset about it but in the video i did say that there was a possibility that this was a mistake okay so um, i did leave that as an option and it seems like you know, at least according to Bandai, it was a mistake and they are going to be fixing it. So if you take a quick look at the Vegito now, instead of what you see on these images, which are still posted at the moment. Um, so yeah, his stats are, are correct. Very good stats, by the way. Leader skill is still the same, but he's going to have Kamehameha as a link instead of Infighter, just like the JP one. And uh, instead of six categories, he should have eight categories, right? The two missing ones. From here are Kamehameha as well as Battle of Wits. And everything else will stay the same, but just the you know inclusion of those two categories, as well as exchanging Infighter for Kamehameha, which is a much better, much more common link, um, makes this unit just significantly better, right? I mean, essentially in line with the JP one, which is all we wanted in the first place, right? Like global players weren't asking for too much. We weren't saying give us a better unit than JP. All we wanted was to be treated fairly, you know, so to be given the same unit. Now, some uh, other differences were the typings for Super Saiyan 4 uh, Broly, as well as the Demon God Deborah. He's actually Extreme AGL, like this guy is Extreme AGL on JP. He's Extreme Fizz for Global, and Broly is Extreme STR for Global, where on, uh, whereas on JP, he's Extreme Tech, right? So, a few differences there, but I don't think they're gonna change those because I do think that they're actually intentional, right? Just like the PyCon and the uh, Angel, Kaoken Angel, Goku, and so on and so forth. There's a few units out there that just have different types between the two versions. I'm not really sure what the justification is, to be honest, but it is what it is. I don't mind it nearly as much as the Vegito thing. Now, to be honest, I do still have one question in mind. Of course, I'm very happy about this. I'm very happy about the fact that they are saying they're going to change the details now. Like they haven't specified it's for Vegito, right? But like you would have to assume it has to be for Vegito. It couldn't be for anything else. Like, could you imagine if they posted this and then only changed the types for Broly and Dabura? They're like, yo, whoops, my bad. We meant to give them the same types, but Vegito was intentional. Vegito is the same. Just take your worse inferior Vegito global. Okay, just accept it. It's not gonna happen. There's no way they're not that stupid, but it would just be hilarious in like the worst way if that was the case. Um, oh, I was saying before, right? I have a question too about. Um, yeah, yeah, I'm a little bit suspicious. Okay, I'm a little bit suspicious about whether or not this was truly a mistake. Because obviously, it says here, you know, the images were found to be incorrect, right? So clearly, what they're trying to say is, yeah, we we effed up. Like somebody over at the Bandai headquarters. Uh, maybe an intern or something like that, uh, you know, accidentally put the wrong link and as well as put, you know, missed two categories for the global post. Um, and that's basically what happened. And we intended to, 
you know, have the same information for both sides. Is, is that true? Or did they actually mean to make Vegito worse on Global, or at least, you know, maybe they thought it wasn't worse, they just thought like, oh, we can make him a little bit different, it'll be fun that way, or something like that. And uh, when they saw the backlash, they realized, oh crap, we effed up, people are mad, and we're gonna lose profits from that, because less people are gonna be, s or, I mean, people are still gonna summon, but maybe less people would summon, or people would spend less stones, because of the, you know, difference between the Vegitos. And when they saw that, when they realized that their profits were at stake, they were like, okay, we gotta change this, we gotta make them the same. Either way, the end result is the same, right? So, um, I'm, I'm very happy about that once again, it's just, I have questions, man, like, how, how did they screw this up this bad? Infighter for Kamehameha, okay, so if it was just that, if it was just the one link, I'd be like, okay, maybe there's some validity to it, but it's the fact that he's missing Kamehameha as a link, and also Kamehameha as a category, that kind of seemed to make it it made it seem like it's intentional, you know what I mean? Like, it doesn't make any sense, because obviously he should have Kamehameha as well as Battle of Wits. But the fact that he was missing the link and the category is kind of weird to me. You know, like, something, something's up. I don't really know. But at the end of the day, we got what we wanted, right? So, I'm not going to ask too many questions. I'm not going to complain. I'm glad that this didn't end up being the ultimate uh, global shaft as, you know, the previous video. Uh, was called and it would have been that exactly it would have been the ultimate global shaft if they hadn't you know said they were going to make these changes but uh there you go guys uh vegeto should be the same on both sides not sure about the types for broly and tabura but i honestly don't care that much um and yeah global players rejoice man our voice has been heard bandai has responded there's their apology for their mistake we'll never really know if it was truly a mistake but once again, I'm accepting it and uh, I'm not gonna you know, press it too much. Okay, um, and is there anything else to talk about? I think there was something else I wanted to say that I like had at the back of my mind, but I totally forgot now. Um, if I remember, I'll let you guys know. Maybe I'll tweet or something like that. By the way, follow your boy on Twitter, eat like Goku on Twitter, and uh, also Instagram too if you guys have that, Tiger Uppercut Media on Instagram. Uh, find out what I'm doing in between the videos or you know get like news updates about new units before I can make the video all that stuff you know just uh all your boy it'd be awesome and that's it guys thank you so much for watching as always if you liked today's video then make sure to like the damn video and if it's your first time watching me first time to the channel and you like what you see oh what oh okay one other thing I want to say um, someone told me, someone told me, actually a couple people told me to delete my previous video because they made the changes, right? And I was like, I'm not gonna do that because at the time I made the video, right, when I made that global shaft video, like, there was definitely global shaftage happening. Yo, it was up to my boy, Jasper, my dog in the background, if you guys heard him. Um, so, you know, that was fact at the time, and... I'm gonna keep that video up because I want it there for for memories for like a chronological, um, what's, what's the term, retelling of like Dokkan's history. So I can remember going back, you know, in the future I can be like, oh, this this is what happened at one point in our history, right? And to also that thumbnail, man. I don't want to delete the video for that thumbnail because it is honestly one of my favorite thumbnails for any of my videos like ever. So uh, I'm gonna keep that. I'm gonna keep that. Okay. Um, anyways guys, yeah, if you like the video, make sure to like the damn video if you're new here and you want to see more Dokkan content from me and other good stuff, then sub to the channel, join the Tiger Squad now, hit that notification bell too so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content, and that's it. I'm out of here until next time. Hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.